We're not doing as much manual data input. Everything's streamlined. It's all centralised in one location. Uh, and it's just the overall efficiency of it. It's been fantastic. Today, I'm at ADP Precision with Anthony, and we're going to find out all about PSL Data Track. But before we do, what was? Can you introduce yourself and your company? Hi, Tom. I'm Anthony Ingleju. I'm one of the directors here at ADP. Um, so. The company was established in 1999. We're based just outside of Newcastle. Uh, we supply to various sectors from oil and gas, subsea, medical, surgical. We're doing a lot of robotics and automation. Um, yeah, so anything really. So, before you got PSL Data Track, what was it like? Um, we always knew we had a good business, but there was a few bottlenecks with regards to there was a lot of duplication with paperwork and traceability and things like that by using a financial system alongside Word, Excel, and it was just cumbersome. But it seemed to be doing a lot of duplication. So where did you actually hear about PSL Data Track? Actually on MTD. Well, that's always nice to hear, <laughs> isn't it? So what was the transition like from not having it to having it? Um, we've got a lot of support, if I'm being honest, from PSL, they were absolutely first class. Um, we give them a lot of their information. They help export it for her. And I'm I'm it was relatively easy, if I'm being honest. So what modules have you got from PSL? Well, we've got all of the modules apart from the quality. I think we've got about 16 out of the 20 modules. Uh, we're now in the process of adding the quality, um, which is the NCR management and the calibration. So I bet that was fun, trying to implement all of their modules together. It, it was, but again, at PSL, but the support they're given, the training, um, was absolutely first class, and they made it... The, very, very easy, the transition. So what's one of the big things about PSL that you found over since you've been using it? Um, we're not doing as much manual data input. Everything's streamlined. It's all centralised in one location. Uh, and it's just the overall efficiency of it. It's been fantastic. So I just want to talk quick about traceability. What's it like being able to sit at your desk, know exactly what's happening on the shop floor, or even if a customer rings, you can just see exactly where their parts are and how long they're going to take. Uh, PSL's made that very easy. All the information's at hand. You can get any information that you need within seconds. It's, it's one of the main benefits of PSL. And we've talked about PSL and how it was implemented, but what about training? Were you and the guys on the shop floor trained for all modulars or modular specific? So myself and the other director, we did train on all the modules, um, but it was very specific for each person's job. Uh, we just trained them on the modules that they would be using and again it was very easy. And talking about the guys on the shop floor, what was their reaction when you tried to implement this and how do they actually use this on the shop floor? Yeah, they use it every day. Uh, it's saved lots of time, it's streamlined the production, it's made it a lot more efficient, it's improved the traceability and that was one of the areas we were concerned about. We thought we might get a bit of kickback off the lads on the shop floor but they've, they've all talked of it fantastically. And, yeah, they've done really well. Well, thank you for letting us here today, and it's been great to hear all about PSL. If you've liked this video or want to know more about PSL Data Track, then leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more.